SEO can be a challenging aspect to master because users need to take charge of SEO, optimize and gain more traffic. In this video, I will introduce you to three free WordPress SEO plugins that will help you to improve your search engine rankings with the trending use of AI. I demonstrate how to install and activate each plugin and I walk through the basic setup options for each plugin. This video is perfect for small business owners, content creators, bloggers, freelancers and agencies. Without any further ado, let's begin. Hey, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Natalie. If you are new to the channel, know this is a channel dedicated to improving your WordPress websites. Kindly consider subscribing to this channel. SEO or search engine optimization is the process of optimizing a website or a web page to improve its visibility and ranking in search engine results pages. SEO is important for website owners because it can significantly impact the amount and quality of traffic that a website receives. In addition to being time-consuming and resource-intensive, achieving full SEO optimization can be a daunting task. That's where these SEO plugins I am about to introduce to you will certainly help you to do this SEO work. An AI Live Assistant operating within the WordPress environment can provide a solution by automating the content generation process. And this is beneficial for you because it allows you to save countless hours of work and valuable resources. However, keep in mind that using any of these plugins does not guarantee you will rank higher. Instead, this is a way to implement your SEO strategy, which means that lengthy, time-consuming tasks will be eliminated. When it comes to SEO modern optimization, the content of a page is what makes it worthy of a search result position. This is the number one factor in terms of SEO. Number two most important factor is the title tag. A title tag is an HTML tag that specifies the title of a web page. Then we have the meta description. It is a HTML element as well that provides a brief summary of a web page. The first WordPress SEO plugin is Rank Math. Is a relatively new SEO plugin that has gained popularity for its user-friendly interface and comprehensive set of features. It offers a range of tools for, for on-page optimization, including advanced content analysis, XML sitemap generation, and schema markup. It provides you more in the free version than with, for example, the Yoast SEO plugin. The easiest way to install RankMath is through the WordPress repository within your website. So, start by hovering over the plugins option in the WordPress menu and then click Add New option. The most popular plugins from the repository will be displayed on the screen. Now search for Rank Math. It's this one. Click once to install the plugin and then click once again to finish the process. Then there is an easy to follow setup wizard to make your life easier. Let's take a look. You see a screen like this one. If you click on this button, you are connecting your free Rank Math account. We can skip that action by clicking on the Skip Now button. If you are thinking about only changing the basics in terms of SEO, choose the first option. Otherwise, go with this advanced option. You can migrate from other plugins. Rank Math can also import the settings from 
another SEO plugin, such as the Yoast SEO plugin. Click to start the wizard. RankMax will ask you some basic questions and based on your answers it will configure the SEO settings so you determine here what type of website this is about you can change to portfolio smart business sites web shop from this drop down list at the bottom you find the skip button although it's not recommended since rankmat will configure the settings based on these replies of course when you connect your rankmat account you are able to set up your google analytics without any third party plugin and you can automatically submit a sitemap to google search console a sitemap is simply a file where you provide information about the pages videos and other files on your site and the relationships between them save and continue and we get this screen message stating that the site is ready to be used and I recommend I suggest to enable the auto update of the plugin this is the rank mat dashboard it has a modular approach meaning you can enable or disable any of these modules and to each of the modules there is a quick settings button which i find it easy to manage one of the first things you could do is to run a seo analysis let's take a look into it. so click on the on the seo analyzer tab and then you click to analyze Analyze your site by clicking rank math account and there is another option but it's a premium where you can analyze the competition you can also optimize your WooCommerce store from this dashboard to enable all you have to do is to toggle on this option I don't have WooCommerce install and that's why I can enable it. if I click now on titles and meta this is organized uh, in uh, easy to follow sections if you switch to the advanced mode of rank mat you will get more extra options there are two ways to access rank mat settings the easiest way is to go to the appropriate section and then access the setting you want and the other alternative method is by using the search box which is located at the top of the page one of the things I like the most is the status and tools tab where you get clear and detailed information regarding your WordPress website things such the number of active plugins about your database about the server let's open the post step we can bulk editing posts right inside here so within this post screen just check if the seo columns are visible in case you are experiencing some issues just click on the screen options at the top of the page and from this screen or from this panel just select the seo columns to display by clicking on this little pencil icon you can insert your focus keyword in this box for each of your posts and you can also use the filtering options to find your seo score your seo score is okay is bad and so on you can utilize the new rank mat feature content ai this is an ai feature where you get unique ai suggestions for related keywords questions and links to include in your seo meta and content area it supports haiti languages you will find now options to configure your target audience and the next option lets you select the post types you want to use the content AI. It really depends now over the membership you hold now. 
Unfortunately, this is a pro feature and Rank Math uses a, a credit system. Every time you research a keyword, a credit will be deducted. And this is a really a standout feature that can be used to streamline your workflow. Another unique feature is the ability of sending sitemap index directly to Google, including feature images. This option really can improve your SEO rankings. Since, as you know, images are so powerful. Finally, I want to mention that RankMath is deeply integrated with Gutenberg Block Editor and Elementor as well while designing your pages. Next one is SEO Press. SEO Press is a comprehensive SEO plugin that offers a range of features for optimizing your website for searching giants. It started in 2017 at the moment it has over 200,000 installations. I have already installed to speed things up. I just need to click on install and it includes tools for on-page optimization, content analysis, local SEO and more. You can configure the SEO press plugin in a few seconds. It has a wizard configuration, just like rank math. It also has artificial intelligence at your disposal. Sadly, this is a pro feature. You may consider to implement it on your SEO strategy. This really can be done in a matter of seconds instead of making manually. It supports WooCommerce when it comes in terms of integrations it's deeply integrated with Elementor Page Builder, Breakdance, Generate Press, Site Origin. What you can do is to make a quick search. For example, if you want to know if the tool is fully integrated with the Astro team, you just check the box and you get a speci special integrations if you use this team. As you can see, it has a ton of tools you can integrate with. Let's run the quick wizard. If you want to import metadata from other from another plugin, so you click here, import meta, and then you select from this drop down list the previous plugin. Then you usually get this screen when you have to determine the identity of your site, how do you like to the home page to be. This third step from SEO installation wizard allows you to specify to search engines what you want to index or not. By default, all types of publications on your site, the most popular being posts and pages, will be indexed. If this option is not suitable for you, just check the corresponding boxes. But remember, the publications will not show up on search engines. In, this, in step number four, you can configure advanced options such as choose to not index the author archive in the search engine results, to redirect file attachment pages to the URL, to shorten the permalinks of your URLs by deleting category. You can leave the default suggested setting. Once again, remember, you can change this setting later. So don't worry. And from this screen, you can manage the title text, the meta descriptions, the no index, and the no follow. If you update to the premium version, besides you have access to the OpenAI tool, it has a very reasonable price. You pay $49 a year for unlimited sites. And if you are a more advanced user, SEO Premium you offers multiple hooks. So for free users, you get eight free hooks and this allows to trigger additional actions or filter data when the page loads. For instance, you can use the white label option using hooks and therefore all references to SEO press will be removed. The last one is scroll SEO. 
I have already installed and activated from the WordPress repository. This is an all-in-one SEO suite tool that takes the guesswork out of search engine optimization. This plugin is intended for people who aren't SEO experts. It offers a different approach than the other plugins. If you open the Squirrel dashboard, you get a quick overview. And if you open the on-page setup, you have three choices, knows SEO, SEO recommended and expert. I go with the expert mode and now there are some configurations needed to be set. So the sitemap XML file is what you are seeing. And this is goes directly to Google Search Console so that Google knows exactly what pages and posts needed to, to be crawled. The color indication is to tell us that these are the pages needed to be crawled by Google. You can customize based on your SEO strategy. If you scroll down, you will find this great feature Ping new posts to search in giants. It's absolutely free of charge. Every time you publish a new post, the plugin will notify the different search in giants. With this, it is possible to rank faster. There are also features to enable meta tags for your titles and descriptions and to optimize keywords. You also get SEO automation enabled by default. What it does, it does avoid title and description duplication. Save and continue as I want to show you more great unique features. This step is to set up the focus page. You need to spend some time with this step. As an example, let's set this post as the focus in order the plugin will do all the work for you. Save and continue. And next is you set here your social media accounts so the plugin can do the work effectively. You input your Twitter account, your Facebook, your link to whatever you have. Save and continue. And the final step is you need to specify what your site is about. I enter WordPress websites, save and continue. Keyword optimization is done while you are writing your article. And this is a bit easier than with Yoast, which often requires you to save articles to see suggestions and results. This plugin does the dirty work for you by scanning through your blog posts and pages. I encourage you to try out different plugins and find the one that works best for your needs. At the end of the day, the choice should be on the one you feel most comfortable with in order to implement your SEO strategy. I recommend you watch the video, the video you are viewing on the screen right now. It's about SEO. Thank you so much for watching. Please like or subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out any of videos.